can do. Walk! I'm but like I'm gonna do like a few like a load of walks with Echo like walk 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 on by Why not? What the hell are you talking about? Yeah. Hi. Wait. Hi Clementines. Yeah. Hi. Nice. Hello. Yeah, I'm good man. I enjoy it. It's been how long's it been? It's been about two and a half two months. Yeah, something like that. two months. Yeah. And I'm loving every second, Sam. Every more. Lovely. Every, every second more. Every <laughs> more every, every second. I'm <laughs> loving it more every second. Taking a picture of a video. A video. Hi, I'm Sam. Hi Sam. I um I think the, there's the odd song that has difficult chords in, isn't there, that took a little while, but I think I got there in the end. <laughs> yeah, you got there in the end. Didn't take too long, and then, um, yeah, I enjoy it, and we get a good atmosphere and stuff, don't we, at gigs and yeah. things, so I'm, I'm in a good place with the Clementines, it's fun. Alright, alright. Always. Right. Set me. The, the music scene in and around Nottingham yeah. is... I would say thriving more at the moment. Past, we had lockdown, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Whereas everything sort of fell apart a little bit. And I feel like it's just coming back into into fruition, and I'm loving it. It's it. Great. Um, man, indie music's prevalent as hell in Nottingham right now. You know, every indie band's getting gigs. So, you, I mean, you just got to look at the month of June for us. We've got like five gigs in June. You know, the indie is popular right now there is such a market for it so I think there's there's nothing that can really stop us other than ourselves at the minute yeah. well, what do you think of the Clementines? Clementines sickest band ever I love the best band in the world that's band in the world. Pretty lit. Hi, Clementines. Hi. Hello. So, um, I've got some questions for you. Um, the first one is, what was your most recent gig and how did it go? It was a P3 at Metronome and it went friggin' amazing. P3 and Metronome, sold that shit It was out. amazing. It was sick. It was a hoot. It was amazing. It, it was awesome. It was sickly awesome. Sickly. And I sickly think awesome. sickly. I think we were at our top form. Yeah. Because we've had a few bum gigs recently, <laughs> and I think we've really hit our thesis. We had a proper Clementine's okay. gig. You know, we hit our quota. Yeah, man. Come. Fuck off. Sam, I'm alright. Fuck boy. I'm joking. I'll get the money. It's fine. Who's having a chance? Did you not get cheap? Can I have one just in case? What has been your most notable gig? Probably selling out with Rough Trade. Uh, 
where we headline. Yeah, 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 yeah. That that one. Or, or the angel. Yeah. Well, the angel gig was huge. It's the one we put up. That's the one we made the most money. Yeah. For charity. Yeah. You know what I mean. <laughs> you, actually I've got the email I did send it to charity good yeah, we've got you 400 quid we raised for charity yeah man yeah. <laughs> you <Seven>. oh <laughs> yeah biblical there you put fun yeah this is all the tour gear for the Clementine slash studio gear this is where we keep all our high tech equipment that's all sound engineer <laughs> this is the comms room. Yeah. I was inside the comms room, sir. It's locked right now. I locked it earlier, so. One more. So far, I think it's really good. It's different to the sound we've made so far. I think there's a lot of different avenues that we're going about, like more funk inspired and a lot of heavier tracks. I think it's sounding great so far, I really like it. What is it like being a Clementine? Shit. Absolutely. No money. <laughs> no, it's great. It's alright. It's liberating. It's, great. it's fun. It defines who I am. I think we're doing really well. I'm really enjoying it. I think it's a really fun and enjoyable experience. You know, it's great. It's just a shame it's coming to an end, I suppose, but you know, all things great in life must come to an end now. Yeah. Fuck. Well, <laughs> There's only one thing easier than kissing Seth Robinson on the lips. What's that, Ollie? Your mum. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. It's good. Some good bands. There's some fairly shite bands. There's, but yeah, there was a band that I saw the other day called Not a Place. They're very good. And um, yeah, I really they're like. A good band. Yeah, Not a Place are very good. So they're kind of cool and. Like a fake band, you know, Charlotte Moon and all that, you know. There's a lot of good shit coming out of Nottingham, but a lot of not great shit as well. But I suppose that's how it's always been there. But yeah, no, I'm, yeah. I'm quite hopeful for the future of this county's music, county culture, I suppose. This is the Clementine's dog now. <laughs> Do you bring her on stage? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we have to bring her to every gig. <laughs> 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 Honestly, like, if they let dogs in a comedian, they'll come. I bet they don't, though. Can you ask? Make the exception. Call them. Nice. Do you remember the band? Like, yeah. yeah. Pretty good. I mean, if I was to be a outside, which is hard to do, I suppose, in this situation, but I think we're adding a lot of cool elements of music, you know, bossing over, funk, jazz and indie music and, you know, rock and all that. We're adding it all together and an amalgamation of something in between, I suppose, and I think it's quite intriguing. Yeah. I like us, you know, but I'm, I'm in it, so I can possibly, I'm not, I'm not an outsider, but from the inside, I think I'm enjoying what we're doing and I think there's a lot of, kind of, um, there's a lot of, Word's gonna come to me. There's a lot of potential. That's it. Nice. We jerk each other off. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we do. <laughs> it's true, though. Is uh, we? Um, <laughs> yeah. My well, should we go? Uh, well, we just. Gonna be watching this, like. Tom's gonna be watching this. I would be. <laughs> we sit together and have a few drinks. Meditate. Meditate. Master. Think about our place in the universe. Yeah. Yeah. How did we get here, guys? I think we are getting stronger as a band. We're really connecting and we're. I think you can tell when we're playing on stage how much we love like playing music to people. Blood! 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 I'll show you any day. Oh, yeah. I think. Particularly considering the most recent gig we've done, um, I think we're definitely getting stronger as a band as a whole, in terms of like, you know how how we present ourselves on stage. You know, stage presence is a big thing, um, 
at least in my eyes, you know, I, I, I'm all about the sort of the idea of the, the vibe between the audience and the band. It's, it's kind of like a make or break thing for me, which is why I try and sort of lose myself when I'm on stage and just really get into the music instead of worrying about screwing things up, you know. I think that's just the best attitude to have. Um, and I think we've struggled with that as a band in, in a few previous gigs and that sort of led to them not being the best but you know you can't win them all at the end of the day you're not going to have a great gig every time that's just the way it is but i i feel like we're we're getting to grips with that whole sort of ideal um and that's shown in the last gig that we did because it was just fantastic the crowd loved it we loved it we all had a good time and it's that kind of vibe that makes a good gig it's something that we all absolutely love doing and I just absolutely love being the Clementines. I love like seeing seeing people sing to our music or dance to our music. I just think it's amazing, and yeah, I just feel like the Clementines are in a good place at the moment. We're going on the right path or the right journey. If that's what you want to call it. It's yeah, it's cool. What do you do as a wind down? How do you come down from? We check each other out. <laughs> 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 no, don't start. Let's <laughs> We uh come down from the gig. We just we all sit together, have a few brewskis, come off, have a couple of drinks, don't we? Stop it, that Okay, sorry. We have a couple of drinks and we just talk about the gig. We reflect. We look inward. <laughs> In a physical sense. Great. Yeah, I'm good, thank you. Yay. Sorry. This is Sam, guys. Uh, who is your favourite Clementine? Oh. Ollie, you go first. Which Ollie? Oh, that Ollie. Sam. Thanks, Ollie. I love you. What love you too. What the hell? Sam, who's your favourite? Me. <laughs> I write the songs. Yeah. I don't have one, they're all arseholes, I don't like them. Bears. <laughs> I'm gonna say Ollie too, because I'm an arsehole sometimes. Yeah, man. <laughs> I'm joking, it's just a joke. Try and write your own songs. I'm joking, I love you all, boys. <laughs> yeah, I'd... This is all about TV screens, you know, so. Why not? I'm with Clemtimes, man, I'm just like a load of. Lights, the lighting. Um. <clears throat> So there we go. <laughs> I don't think Seth. any of us are hard to work with. Seth is. Fuck off. <laughs> no. Yeah, maybe a little bit. Yeah, I am really, aren't I? I'm the hardest one because when we record vocals, I just keep. You get a little temperance. What do you mean? You, you, you sort of pipe up. So it's not right, then you're a bit unhappy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You do do what I? I mean. Yeah, I've got a video, so insert the video now. <laughs> What, me getting angry? Yeah, you smacking your guitar. I get, well, I'm... I'm smacking me. I'm, I'm smacking all of you. I'm a dedicated artist, man. What can I say? He's passionate. You're passionate. And that can sometimes be... Um, um, the word passionate lover, the word passionate... Counterproductive. Oh. So, I'm being honest because I love you. It's okay. We get through it. Oh my god. Da, da, da. Oh my god. So smooth, man. Yeah. 
In keeping with the theme, who smells the most? Set. Yeah. Oh, bullshit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Unanimous. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> Fuckers. I feel like I'm getting... This is just a fucking... <laughs> so, Seth no, roasting. Set. Roast of Seth. I quit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, what's up? Welcome to MTV Cribs today. Yo, we're in my home studio. Uh, this is the studio. It's, a, it's a, you know, you know, it's just, this is pretty self-explanatory equipment. We got a couple of dials. We got uh, that's a coat hanger, I think. Uh, we got this is a mini fridge. This is my Xbox. This is where my PC used to be before it blew up. Couple wide flat screen TVs. <laughs> Seth Robinson is hit the gym right now. MTV Cribs. This is my crib. Thanks. Anyway. <laughs> Shit as always. <laughs> I hate it. I wake up every day miserable. I go to bed miserable, but I tell you what, that's how I write good songs. Constant misery. The people love us, though. Yeah. The people love us. What's that? It's going great. It's um, great, I love it. We absolutely love being in the club. I can love it. Sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> Jake, we all love being the common times. Yeah. It's uh, fun, it's exhilarating. Oh, it's. Let it be known. Sell out. Hate the coming times. Death worn down. We're coming for you. One for the fans. Is there any new material to, material coming out? Any new songs? Yeah, there is. If you've been to any of our gigs, you'd have heard a couple of them. Yeah, we've got a uh, what like we've got a five track five EP track EP on the way in the world. We, uh, we've got some new sounds coming out. We're going in a heavier direction. With like Ooh, the we're getting creative. We are like, like uh, we're getting creative. Yeah, we're going to be we're, we're gaze out in to there. expectations. That's a good. That's, ooh, that's a word now. In a in a cosmological way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we are. We're yeah. We're opening new. We're we're just trying out new things. Exploring new horizons. Yeah. yeah. So, talking about new material, what is your songwriting process? I write the song. We jerk each other <laughs> off. <laughs> well, but for our sing song, so you make the jam. We'll I make, make the jams jam. together, and I write all the good songs. <laughs> I write the songs and this is I... why you're the hardest to work with. <laughs> I write the songs, I make acoustic demos of them, I bring them to the band, and then all of us go, wow, well, well, I'll do this, and I'll do that, and then that's how it's formed. But it's pretty much just me, really. I'm the backbone of the band, if I'm being honest. It's true. I've, I've done quite a lot of the writing this time. Well, at least the sort of the, the genesis of the music. You feel me? You feel me? I feel you. Yeah. So I've got one more question for you. Who are your main influences, like each of you? So Ollie, again, you go first. Oh God. I don't know. I like a lot of music, man. Like, you know, I grew up on rock and roll. My dad was this guy from the '60s who raised me on like Led Zeppelin and stuff. But, you know, I've, I've met a lot of people along the way. Like my best friend Dan Bennett got me into <coughs> reggae. This guy got me into all the blues and the funk. Who? Oh, me, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, so I, I'd say at the minute it was like, it was 
uh, as a musician that I am now. Probably people like you know, uh, Joe Dart from Wolfpack, Flea, which is an obvious one, Marcus Miller, um, uh, what's his name, Matt Keane. Hey man, we've only He's got a four great minutes. Minutes. <laughs> Hey man, let me have my moment. <laughs> yeah, there's a few. Chili Peppers is the main one. I'm drinking your drink, by the way. Um, Ollie Wells Turner, <laughs> my mum, uh, Bob Dylan. Um, this is all weird names, isn't it? God. Ollie's <laughs> mum and Bob Dylan. Just, you know, living and breathing and smelling and taking in all that I can. Um, fucking corny as shit. Uh, the police. The actual police or the band? Both. Nice. <laughs> the band. Guitars go. <laughs> John Mayer, uh, <laughs> Seth, Thanks, babe. genuinely though Seth, and then um, quite like John Frusciante from the Chili Peppers. Yo, oh yeah, uh, big time. And then there's there's plenty, but that's three for you. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I'll clear everything. Uh, probably Mike DeMarco. Um, Taylor Hawkins from the Foo Fighters. Nice. Rest in peace. Rest in pieces. Um, yeah, just super cool. Um, <laughs> super cool indie people like that. <laughs> and, yeah. and you. Namaste. And you too. Thanks. Lovely. See you later. Bye. Bye.